You can go a little bit lower. Can I do 15? Last time you were here. Mm hmm As a favor to you, yes. What's going on, YouTube? My name is Rocket. If you don't know, I am out for garage sales. I'm going to hit a couple of community sale and then I'm going to go to the red, white, and blue flea market because it's supposed to rain in Florida. It hasn't started yet, but it, it looks like it's going to. So I'm going on the shelter. Um, I did end up picking up a couple of things. I picked up an Xbox 360 um, for $15. You guys didn't get to see that. Sorry about that. So I should be able to get 85 to 100 once I add some games and, and some different things. Um, and I stopped by what you will get to see is me stopping by this man's sale. He keeps all of these VHS and DVDs and books. He's got Stephen King's The Shining. He's got original series in there. Um, I tried to show you guys as much of his little store as possible. It's a little pricey. He wants anywhere from five to ten dollars for them, but it's worth it. The last time I picked up about six VHS, it was the Freddy Krueger. Um, I paid about 25 for it because he wanted more money than I wanted to establish a relationship and um, I ended up selling it for about $60 so I made a profit I'm happy about it. It took a little while to sell it so I, I bought it before Halloween and it didn't sell till um, after January so still glad it sold I saw his sign up stopped in today and I ended up picking the first four Hellraisers up don't know what it's worth, but I talked him down to $15 for the four. And then I also picked up a Thor. I don't know what that value is either, but it was five bucks, threw it in. So for $20, I got five VHSs. I'm um, looking forward to looking at what they're worth. I should make my money back. I don't think I'll have a problem making my money back on those, but he has so much. I want to go home, do more research, see what's worth um, the money, and then I want to come back. Um, anyway, so today is Saturday. I'm on my way to the thrift store. As you all know, the name is N and R Flippers, and you usually see the R, which is Rocket, but you never get to see the N. Well, here she is. Her name is Nicole. I named my business N and R Flippers. N for Nicole. Say hi. That's hi the wife right there. That's the wife right there. I'm excited. She took a day off and she's out <laughs> with me. You guys don't understand how amazing that is. So this is N and R Flippers. And um, you're going to see us, you know, throughout the day cutting up and um, buying some stuff. Well, I'll be buying the cell. She doesn't buy the cell. I can't get her. I can't get her to flip with me I yet. I buy for pleasure. She buys for pleasure. I'm holding out, y'all. That's why I named it N and R Flippers. I'm holding out that someday... She will come to her senses and she will join me. We will join forces and we will become mighty. Anyway, you know, guys know, as always, I'm going to show you what I buy, tell you why I buy it. And if you haven't liked and you haven't subscribed, I would truly appreciate it. That's it, guys. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Good morning. So much vintage here, guys. I've purchased from you before. I remember you. Yeah, I got some, um, about uh, five or six of, um, Nightmare on M Street from over here. It was BHS. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you got some good stuff, man. Oh, I try to. Don't always succeed as the same goes. Yeah, I got you. And you had some Stephen King books. I remember that. Thanks to friends and relatives. Sometimes I got so much stuff I can't remember all of it. <laughs> and it's so much fun around Halloween and then Christmas. Mm hmm. Stuff in to get stuff out. Hellboy. Didn't they? They made a second Hellboy, didn't they? I think they did. There was Hellboy, sequel to Hellboy. There was some stuff in cartoons. Hmm. And then there was a new Hellboy. Yeah. 
I Trevor remember Lynch, that. Free live action movie. I think Ron Perlman was showing away in the first two. The one that I really wanted from you was, um, this is the one with the spikes, Hellraiser. You probably got rid of that, right? You got a ton of uh, different ones, series. I remember them being somewhere over here. They were here. Any particular Hellraiser? Um, a few of them, if you have them. How many you, you have? See, well, I've got stuff in here. Yeah. I've got stuff stored in the office. Oh, okay. And like, uh, it's just about time for me to switch stuff from. As a matter of fact, I would start today. Mm. Well, let me see what I've got. Okay, I see you got the Halloweens. Let's see what he is open. The Return of Michael Myers. Halloween 3, 5. This is incredible. Prophecy. I know I don't have all of them, but uh, I think these are the first four. Nice. Okay. Hellraiser, let alone Hellraiser 3. Hellraiser and Hellbound. Hellraiser, attach me Hellraiser 2. I see. Hellraiser. This thing used to scare me as a child. Jeez. Well. First time I saw this, I said, hmm, acupuncture going wild. Yeah. Yes, it is. So this... This is two, this is three. Which was the first? That's the first, I think. Okay. Oh, yes, because I remember the cube. I remember him solving the cube. That was scary. So this is four. I think that's number four. Hmm. 20 bucks, huh? You can go a little bit lower. Can I do 15? other things. Let's see what else you have. I was just going to say, considering last time you were here, mm -hmm. as a favor to you, yes. Okay, thank you so much. I appreciate it. And honestly, that day you made my day. Yeah? I was saying, oh, nobody's going to buy anything. No, you but have a... Some nice people stopped by and then you came along and yeah, because you have some, some nostalgia. You have some great stuff, and people should definitely buy yeah, the Thor. That's a cartoon. What? The Thor. Oh, yeah, these are the early cartoons. Wow. Uh, oh, wow. Do you collect comic? Oh, this is sealed, okay. Yes, they all should have some channels. I'll see the price. Oh, it that's is five, rubbed basically. Okay. That's five? Yeah. Okay, I'll give you 20 for that and that. Okay. Okay. You shall do that. You don't like this stuff in the back? No, I'm okay. I have a bag in my trunk. When you do it again, I'll uh, come back and think about the books and everything. Thank you so much. I'll keep a lookout and come back. You have a great day. All right, guys, we're outside the red, white, and blue. I do call it an expensive thrift store, but it's okay. We're going to go in here and see if we can find anything. This one only tagging along to find storage, but I'm just glad you're with me. So thanks for me. <laughs> anyway, guys, you know I'll show you what I find. So let's get in here.
see what we can find. Look at that. That is pretty freaking cool new era tags. Five bucks. Willow tree. Mm -hmm. uh, it's usually the ones with the family. I sold that one for 75. Twenty bucks, forty bucks. Should be six. Wish there was more of them. All right, guys, so I only got three things. I picked up this, um, I picked up this Halloween 
it was only three dollars i don't know if it works you know i don't know if y'all pick up things ahead of halloween but i'm pretty sure this would have been twenty dollars if i picked it up one person on macari is selling it for about forty dollars so i'm gonna probably price it on ebay for 25 and just wait for it to sell i think halloween is one of those occasions where people buy things year along all year long so it's, it's plastic but i'm looking forward to see how it sounds and i picked up this chicago bulls embroidery on his sick it feels so good it looks like it's still new it was on sale for 14.98 it's new era i'll show you the, the back i don't know if this thing is popular but i picked it up for five dollars it's pretty nice oh it's from dtlr okay it's a hardwood classic dtlr that's theirs that's why okay five bucks and i picked up these comics it was ten dollars i was able to look up one of them i think this one i think it's selling on ebay for about ten dollars so i'll make my money back i didn't know what else was in here it looks like another star wars number 31 um obi-wan kenobi marvel one so i think i know for sure i'll be able to make my money back um this is pretty cool actually Honestly, I don't know anything about comics. Any, honestly, I know nothing about comics, but people love Star Wars, and I figured at least I'd be able to make my money back. <laughs> 